Hello, good evening to you, wherever you are. The first piece of news to bring you is the fact that the heavens have opened. A rainy night here. I'm Derek Ray, and keeping me company here on the commentary gantry is Stuart Robson. And we can't wait for this one to start with justifiable cause. It's Portugal versus Kerala Blasters. Well, thanks, Derek, as always. The scene is set, two good teams, a great playing surface, and a vibrant atmosphere. It has all the ingredients for a really exciting game. Here's how it looks for Portugal. Rui Patricio is the keeper. Bernardo Silva plays alongside Bruno Fernandes in central midfield. And it's two strikers up front who will look to provide the goal-scoring threat. Let's have a look at the initial 11 for the visitors. Well, I think they have a nice balance to their team. A solid back four, two holding midfielders, three creative players in advance of them, and a mobile centre forward. It's a good team. And they kick off here. In behind for him to chase. A real opening now. Oh, a moment of pure class. Had to catch it perfectly. And didn't he just? Well, here's the replay. What a superb volley this is. He strikes it so cleanly, and he times it perfectly. So, back underway. Having conceded, let's find out if Portugal can flick a switch and come up with a goal of their own. Joao Felix... Guerrero, Bruno Fernandes, just the challenge that was required. <coughs> well, that's one for them to pursue. Credit to them for winning back possession. And he's in. And a goal this time, applying the finishing touch. Just what the doctor ordered. Well, first of all, where's the defending? They're all over the place. But give him some credit. That's a good finish. Great composure. So the ball rolling again. 2-0 the score. Cancelo. No, high quality defending. Guerrero. Not too fussy in clearing his lines. Cristiano Ronaldo. It's with Joao Cancelo. Guerrero. And on to Felix. Must score! 
and there it is! Still life left in this game, and they have the momentum now. Well, it's great awareness of space in the box, and then he shows a lot of composure with the finish. That's a clever goal. Moving once more, and Portugal undeniably right back in this contest now. Diamantakos, perfect tackle. Joao Cancelo. Possibly a yellow card as their flow was stopped. And following the infringement, a caution. Yeah, no surprise there. That was always going to be a booking. He's played it short here. Bruno Fernandes. That's all they can conjure for now. Can they do something positive on the counter-attack? And they'll regard that as a very disappointing end to the move. Palinha. It's with Joao Cancelo. Bruno Fernandes, and options in the centre. That's a very fine piece of tackling. Oh, great defending. Well, that's gone out, and it is going to be a goal kick. And Bernardo Silva has it. Ronaldo! Oh, denied by the post. Well, nothing comes of it. Well, it was certainly a chance to get back into the game. And you have to say they're a bit unfortunate. But they do need to finish off one of these chances. Yes, so near indeed. But now they've got to concentrate on keeping their defensive shape. Real chance. Well, not the easiest of saves, but you'd expect him to stop it. Played over. Oh, off the line. High class defending right on the goal line. Well, Portugal had more of the possession, as you can see, but without really creating enough chances. They've almost passed the ball for the sake of it. They need to start getting it into their front players much quicker to get back into this. Well, certainly, and here they are passing the ball around once more. Well, they're doing their best to get on level terms here. Well, it's a decent effort, but they're still trailing. They need something special here. And he takes it away.
Did well to win the ball back. Oh, it comes to nothing in the end. Really should have made more of that. Well, quite frankly, it's been a struggle for Cristiano Ronaldo, not having anything like the impact we would expect from a player of his calibre, Stuart. Well, as you can see, he just hasn't had enough touches in the key areas, and that's one of the reasons they're losing this game at the moment. Almost at half-time, it's going the way of the visitors as things stand. Stuart, what have you made of what you've seen? Well, it's been a lively first half, hasn't it? Both sides have looked dangerous, but I think they do have a bit more guile in the top third of the pitch, and that's been key to them leading at the moment. Joao Cancelo. Bruno Fernandes has it. And if you're wondering about added time, two minutes it'll be. Fernando Silva. On to Ronaldo. Spectacular save. Top class goalkeeping. Well, just listen to the fans. They know this is a big chance here. And there's the delivery. And the whistle is sounded for half-time in this game. Marshall well, Felix played his part in the first half. Sum up his contribution for us. Yeah, he's done okay in that first half. He's had a lot of the ball, he's used it well, and he's been energetic. But unfortunately, that can't be said about the rest of the team, who need to improve if they're going to turn this around. To, to go to the bench at this stage of the game. <laughs> Playing it short. Bernardo Silva. Oh, that's textbook goalkeeping. Favouring the short one. A good and fair challenge. Now another corner following on from the last one. Now sending it in. And both hands on it. Good goalkeeping. Determined defending. Joao Felix. Bruno Fernandes. How about the cross? Pressing high, and they have the ball again. Guerrero. Onto Ronaldo. Ronaldo! Well, getting in the way. Superb save. Going for the short one. So following the deflection, a corner kick coming up here.
They take it short. Ronaldo, a glorious chance. Oh, crucial tackle. Brilliant. Thirty minutes to go then. Opportunity here. And there it is! A two-goal cushion now. And they just need to keep the concentration. Well, here's the replay. And just look how quickly they break forward once they win the ball back. And it makes the striker's job so easy. All he has to do is make the right connection. It's a lovely goal. So back underway, 3-1 the score. Joao Cancelo. Danilo Pereira. And he's won the ball. He's got the score! And he's made it a brace for himself. The defender's just unable to stay with him. And he's having a field day. Well, as you can see, they finished this really easily. They don't give the keeper a chance, do they? That's a good goal. Well, sadly, we have to conclude that this hasn't really been a contest, but all credit to any side committed to scoring goals like this. Really showing off his wide range of passing skills. And a good challenge to bring that attack to an end. Bernardo Silva sliding it through. Well, the fans really want him to shoot. And a goal this time. Applying the finishing touch. Just what the doctor ordered. Well, here it is again, and it's all about the pace on the counter-attack. They were so quick to break out from their defensive positions, and this is Ronaldo at his best. He's composed, he shows great technique, and he just smashes it beyond the keeper. <laughs> 20 minutes to go. So the current scoreline, 4-2. Oh, wonderful goalkeeping. Well, you have to say, from that sort of distance, that's a wonderful save. He's driven in the corner. It might still be problematic. Takes the shot. And a goal! Wonderful stuff as they accelerate away from the opposition. Well, I have to say, this is a really good goal. Just watch his technique here. He just hits through the back of the ball with such power. There's no stopping that. And as they restart the game, it's fair to say the gulf in quality between the two sides has been huge. Bruno Fernandes. Ronaldo at the ready. Well, it still could be dangerous. Bruno Fernandes. Fine goalkeeping to push that away. 
corner awarded. Well, they have elected to go to the bench at this stage of the game. But he's gone short with it. He read the situation defensively and did his job. Adrian Luna. And he did well to cut it out. Almost at full time, and I'll tell you what, playing away from their home patch has been a pleasant experience for them, Stuart. Well, what an excellent performance this has been. They've had complete control for most of the game. Their movement, clever passing and energy have been a joy to watch. It's been a really good win for them. And Ronaldo takes on the shot. Well, the free kick fired too close to the goalkeeper. Luna. Chance to run at them. Oh, he's through here. And that's the hat trick. Tearing apart this defence time and again. They simply can't handle him. Let's see this again, because the delivery into the box couldn't be any better. Played into just the right area, which makes it a fairly simple finish in the end. It's a really good goal. Well, if there were any lingering doubts about the outcome, surely they now have been removed. Bruno Fernandes. Joao Cancelo. Bruno Fernandes has it. Felix. Determined defending. It'll be a corner. Can someone get on the end of this? Well, he made great contact with that one, but the goalkeeper had his own ideas. And the corner has been given. Delivering it, and an effective clearance. Joao Felix. On the ball, Joao Felix. Full credit, wonderful stop. Breaking at pace. Really poor timing, and some will argue that he was asking for a yellow card. And following the infringement, a caution. Yeah, no surprise there. That was always going to be a booking. And there's the feed into the box. Not messing around with that clearance. Tremendous ball played through. 
Leal. Now with Ronaldo. And blocked for now. He scored once already and close to making it a double. Well, every time he gets on the ball, he looks a real danger today. Trying to deliver it accurately. And that's a straightforward stop. And the referee makes it official. Well, this hasn't gone Portugal's way. Not at all what they had in mind. Stuart, sum it up for us. Well, Derek, the fans are right to expect more. The tempo of their passing was too slow. They were second to the ball too many times and were beaten by the better side today.